Hey guys, I'm just popping in to give you a quick video on how to apply Roman clay. This was a DIY that I was a little intimidated to try at first, but it's actually super easy. All that you really need is a spackle knife and the Roman clay. Apply it to your spackle knife and spread it onto your surface going in different directions. Go back over each area a couple of times so you don't leave it too thick in any one area. I practiced on some practice boards before I actually started on the fireplace itself. Be sure to cut in around the edges as you go. I found this wood mantle on Facebook Marketplace and added the custom surround made from layers of plywood. And each layer was cut out with an arch. Then I primed the plywood with white primer and let it dry before I started with the Roman clay. I did one full coat of the Roman clay in the color Patagonia. I got it from Portola Paints and Glazes online. They have a whole bunch of colors that you can pick from. Their tutorials suggest sanding after the first coat dries and then applying a second coat. I stopped after the first coat because I liked the color. It, was, it actually looks darker in person than it does on camera. So I only did one coat and no sanding. I was totally happy after the first one. The Roman clay actually mimics the look of real stone. Um, so it's a great budget friendly way to get that look. And you can use it not just on fireplaces, but you can use this on your walls or anywhere else that you want some texture and the look of real stone. It's very cool. The brick that you see in the arch there, which is white, is actually a veneer panel that we got at the Home Depot. We used that from the background, and I ended up painting that black when I was done to give that arch the illusion of more depth. We custom designed the whole wall around this faux fireplace. Um, my husband did with molding. We wanted to add some architectural detail and a focal point to our otherwise clean living room. A great way to give some interest to a boring, build a grade, plain, boxy room. But I highly recommend the Roman clay if you like the look of natural stone and it's just the easiest DIY. I was completely shocked at how easy this was and very happy with the results. You can find more details and the links all in the blog post. I will leave a link at the end of the video.